what if i told you the value of diamonds are worthless they were never rare they were never a good investment diamond prices are crashing and yet we still keep buying them why let's uncover the truth behind diamonds in this video you learn why diamond prices are crashing fast why resale value is a joke how lab grown diamonds change everything how advertisements made diamonds symbolic to romantic stuff and what their future value looks like stick till the end this truth might shock you and you learn something good sparkle of diamond isn't just magic it's all about science diamonds are rated using the famous four c's cut determines how well a diamond reflects light it's all about sparkle color refers to the diamond's hue with less color being more valuable clarity measure the imperfections the fewer the better carat is all about weight bigger isn't always better but it sure is a shiny while you are shopping for a diamond remember the four c's now let's compare the cost of making one carat diamond was one carat diamond extracting naturally so lab grown diamonds are usually created using cvd or hphd machines done in 20 days by applying heat and pressure on carbons usually it costs about 25 to 40000 rupees only whereas when comes to extracting one carat diamond usually we have to dig around 250 tons of soil we need to use diesel water manpower machinery and later we have to polish it grind it and later we have to pay taxes like customs and the showroom price may be around uh, 3 to 5 lakhs per one carat diamond which extracted naturally so both are same in chemical and physical properties and but one is sold with science and one is sold with nature or emotions so why do people still buying diamonds because we were trying to through ads movies songs weddings we were told a bigger ring means bigger love no diamond no commitment but none of it is real you can show love with meaning not with marketing here is the truth diamonds are not rare they don't hold any value they lose money the moment you buy them they were marketed to you not for you so next time when someone says buy diamonds to show your love ask yourself are you buying for love or falling for a shiny trap let me show you how to calculate diamond value if you are trying to buy any diamond jewelry for example it has 0.75 carat diamond vvs to h currently the price of rapropate estimate is about 3700 dollars so the final price may be rapropate price or carat price by carat weight for example 3700 into your diamond value 0.75 equals to 2775 dollars that's how they calculate diamond prices and they add value addition like making charges taxes so on so we have to pay them natural diamond prices dropped over 25 percentages whereas lab grown diamonds crashed almost 70 percentages since 2020 this isn't a dip to buy this is a collapse why because diamonds are no longer a rare item we can simply grow in labs within 2 to 3 weeks same sparkles same hardness same carbon compounds and structure so when something wants rare becomes common what happens prices crashes hard right yes that's what happened we believe diamond symbolizes love so that's why we buy diamond jewelry but that idea was manufactured in 1940s one company owned by dbs controlled 80% of the world's diamond supply so they reduce the supply and increase the demand and it results the prices of diamonds to increase or get attention by everyone who is their love they launched a campaign a diamond is forever yes it's romantic right but it wasn't about love it was about stopping you from selling or reselling your diamond if people don't sell the market looks stable and the prices will be stable and the supply of them can be released slowly and they can sell anything at what they want prices genius marketing but not emotional truth now let's talk about what's happening in india you walk into a jewelry store 
big banners no wastage on diamonds flat 50 percent off on diamonds sounds like a steal right you think it's a good deal you get a discount maybe some valentine's day or mother's day or something so that you get a discount they're offering like that but reality not that ask them is it a natural diamond or lab grown diamond most people don't even know there's a difference and many jewelers won't even clearly explain it to you they'll show you a certificate but from where only a few labs like GIA and IGIA are trusted. What about others? Maybe some kind of fake or some kind of showcase stuff like that. And here's the dark part. Some jewelers sell lab grown diamonds at natural diamond prices. They said it's natural, but when you ask the certificates or anything, they simply say, you don't need like that. We take diamonds as it is same price, like a buy by value like that. But in reality, when you try to sell it, you see the real part. You'll never know. You'll walk out thinking you got a deal, but maybe you you just get food, I think maybe. Maybe. India's inflation is around six to seven percent every year. Even if your diamond holds its price, you're still losing its value. And most don't even hold its price. So what if everyone knows the difference between lab grown and natural diamond and they simply buy lab grown diamonds in order to cost cut because they both are physically chemically same components same properties so think before you buy diamond don't grow like gold mutual funds they don't protect your wealth invest in gold or mutual funds or stocks for better returns if your primary stuff is to increase your wealth now let's talk resale value of diamonds you buy a ring of 1.5 lakh worth and later you want to sell it and get quieted about 60,000 or even sometimes less some stores just say we don't buy back diamonds no standard pricing no guarantee no price protection with lab grown diamonds even worse most jewelry refuses to upset it at all if this video opened your eyes, follow 01 Byte for more exclusive content. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.